This is Jared Duquette with the Illinois DNR Wildlife Division. For the next few minutes, I'm going to give you a brief tutorial on a brand new website we just developed called Wildlife Illinois. If you type into your browser, www.wildlifeillinois.org, it will take you directly to the site. Now, we developed this site to help you quickly and effectively solve any wildlife concerns or issues you may have around your home or your property. We designed the site to be friendly not only to desktop computers, um, but especially to your smartphone. We designed the site in collaboration with several partners that you can see down here at the bottom. Now let's go through some of the great tools and information the site has, starting with Get Help. In this section, this area will help you quickly solve any wildlife issues you have. Take, for example, you want to solve a wildlife problem immediately, or maybe you see an injured animal, or you want to remove wildlife, or even repair damage to your home. You can find information and tools on that in this section. Now let's say if you see animals in your area, you can go up here to the sightings tab. And this will give you all kinds of information on different wildlife, including species like coyotes here at the top, and many other different topics. Down here at the bottom, we've provided you a link to report any unusual wildlife you may see around, uh, particularly around your property here. Now, if you want to know more about wildlife and maybe learn how to identify different animals, you can go here to the wildlife identification tab. And in this section, we've split it up into several different types of information. You can find photos and information on animal signs, such as tracks, or you can find information on specific species in categories like mammals, birds, and amphibians and reptiles down here at the bottom. Now let's take, for example, if you want to know more about coyotes, you can click on cat or dog-like animals. And in here you will find coyotes. And this will pull up all kinds of different information on coyotes, say the positive benefits of the species, but also a description and identification of them. And you can scroll through it and learn a lot more about them in these different accordion tabs. Now let's say you want to prevent problems around your home before wildlife become an issue. You can go here to the prevent problems tab, click on that. And we have a wealth of information as well here on ways and tools that you can use to prevent any type of wildlife issues or even concerns before they happen. Now let's say you get to the point where you want to hire a nuisance wildlife control operator you can go to that tab here, Hire a Wildlife Control Operator. And if you click on that, the website will pull up a map of all these different pins, which represent all of the nuisance wildlife control operators that serve Illinois. And if you pick your respective zip code, let's take this one for example, the map will automatically zoom in to nuisance control operators that are fairly close to your zip code. And if you click on that, particular pin maybe closest to your house, it's going to pull up a list not only of the names but also the phone numbers of nuisance control operators in your area. Now let's say you have a specific species that you're concerned about. You can click on this other query option and let's take bats for example. The map will further refine what nuisance control operators handle bats in your area and you can click on those as well. Now we've also provided you a link here that you can click on to consider non-lethal options before you would consider hiring a professional nuisance control operator. Now let's say you see an injured animal and want to work with a wildlife rehabilitator. We've given you a similar option here at the top called find a wildlife rehabilitator, which will pull up a very similar map of all the wildlife rehabilitators in the state. And similarly, you can click on your respective zip code or even type it in here and it will pull that zip code up in your area. And then you can also query by what type of animals that the wildlife rehabilitator handles. Now the other option that's probably useful for many people is the search function here in the top right corner. And say if you just want to know immediately more information about raccoons, you can type in raccoon. And the website will pull up everything on the website that relates to raccoons. And so that's a really quick and easy way to query if you have specific questions. Now I hope I've given you a little bit of background on this brand new website and hope it not only will give you some tips and tools to help you mitigate any wildlife concerns that you have, um, but also provide you some information on how to prevent those concerns and know more about the great wildlife in the prairie state.